Hey guys and welcome to Aussie Reviews. Well today I'm checking out the 27 watt LED handheld spotlight from Pro Tactical. Now uh, you guys may have caught my previous review that I did on the uh, 15 watt LED. I was pretty impressed with it, you know, and uh, now they've got this 27 watt um, LED so I'm really keen to give it a run. So let's just do the unboxing and just show you what comes with it. So pretty much not much comes in the pack. Um, once again, we don't have any instructions. Um, that seems to just be standard. So if you want to find out more, you've got to log onto the website. So we've got the uh, car charger here from the cigarette lighter. Got the uh, wall charger. And we've simply got the spotlight itself. So the first thing I notice about this spotlight, guys, is just how compact it is. I mean, it's only a 120 mil reflector. I mean, look how <laughs> compact that is. It is very sturdy, so a little bit more weight than their 15 watt version. It's 540 grams or 19 ounces overall. Now it's got an aluminium reflector with a plastic handle. The plastic handle has the finger mold, or the finger grooves molded into the handle, I should say. And you've got a very positive on and off click there. I have noticed that you can't adjust the actual beam. That is fixed. But we've got 27 watts in total, which consists of nine uh, Cree three watt bulbs. And it's pumping out 2000 lumens. So it's gonna be uh, fairly interesting to see what the practical um, you know, application of this is out on the farm. Now it's uh, rechargeable. All you need to do is just use the wall adapter or the cigarette lighter adapter. It takes about three and a half hours to recharge. Now the runtime on this is between one and two hours. A little bit less obviously than their um, 15 watt version because you know, you're know you doing almost twice the, the amount of lumens out of this little compact one. 7.4 volt lithium battery and the price point on this is $179 from Queensland Gun Exchange. So once again guys, look the pro tactical stuff uh, I believe is made in China. Um, so you know I'm always a little bit hesitant of that. But as you guys uh, may have seen with the last 15 watt review that I did, I was just super impressed. Like it was a, just a fantastic product um, and at the right price point, you know, which made it affordable for everyone. So anyhow, enough talking guys, let's get this out on the farm. And I'd actually like to compare it side by side with the 15 watt um, LED spotlight from Pro Tactical. So you can see which one best suits your purpose. Okay, so we've just turned the spotlight on guys and just shining it pretty much at our feet here just so you can have a look at the beam. So, um, reasonably wide beam, but geez, it's bright, isn't it? Like, uh, you can really see the difference between this and some of the other LED spotlights that I've looked at. Okay, so I've ranged this tree at 106 yards. So as you can see, it just lights up the entire tree. You can see the branches, you can see the leaves. Um, you know, so if you were aiming um, for game or looking at game with this spotlight at that distance, it'd easily pick it up. Okay guys, so we're at 353 yards here, okay? As you can see, the beam is probably too wide and uh, the camera would be struggling to actually uh, focus. So look, I doubt you'd be shooting at that distance with this spotlight. Um, however, let's go to a shorter distance now and uh, compare it to the 15 watt LED from Pro Tactical, just so you get an idea and you can see what I mean by the different um, beam width. Okay, so 158 yards away here guys, so you could clearly see any game at that distance. But what I wanna demonstrate here is on the left, the beam there is from the uh, 15 watt LED, if you saw that review that I previously did. And on the right hand side, we've got the 27 watt LED. So the 27 watt LED certainly lights up a hell of a lot more area. But from what I can see here with the actual uh, 15 watt LED, because it's a more narrow beam, I think it's actually gonna penetrate um, you know, out to those longer distances. Okay, so we've got some volunteer steers again here guys on the farm. So, you know, they're only about 60 yards away. And as you can see there on the camera, I mean, look at the area that this little spotlight, you know, illuminates. It really is quite good. Like, I mean, if you're going for game out anywhere up to 200 yards, like seriously, this spotlight just lights up a hell of a lot of area.
All right, guys, I'm going to wrap up my final thoughts on the 27 watt LED handheld spotlight from Pro Tactical. Now, honestly, what a compact little unit this is. It's got a little bit more weight than their uh, 15 watt LED, but still, that 2000 lumens just pumps straight out of there. Now, one thing that I would like um, you know, to see in this spotlight is like the 15 watt LED version, is I'd like to see an adjustable um, you know, lens on it so that I can actually make the beam a lot more narrower or wider depending on the distance that I'm actually using this at. But apart from that, I mean, guys, look, you know, $179 from Queensland Gun Exchange. It's a pretty good uh, spotlight. I can't say it's let me down. I've been playing with this for some nights now and it's a really good spotlight. I actually was able to pick a fox up, you know, at 400 yards with it, even though I couldn't see really the outline too well until I looked through the scope. You could just see the reflection from the eyes straight away. So, yeah, it's definitely got a lot of power in it. But for reasonable, um, realistic shooting distances, I wouldn't be using this over anywhere over 200 yards. Anyhow, guys, that's my honest thoughts on it. Hope you enjoy the review. So till next time, we'll catch you then.